Hey everybody, it's Cheryl from That's What She Said. I am going to show you today my tutorial for making um, a little fabric flower. So, let's get started. Okay, what you'll need. You will need hot glue gun, glue sticks, scissors, fabric, preferably fabric that is um, color on both sides. So some fabrics are um, printed on the cotton, and so the back is kind of like white or muted, and then the front is a color. So I like when it's the same color on both sides. And a scrap piece of paper that I cut out into a flower. Now I just want to say, however large you make, it, this flower does not have to be perfect at all. Just freehand a flower. Um, but as large as you make this will be similar as what your flower will be um, in the end. So right here that's what you got so I just cut this little flower out of a scrap piece of paper I had laying around and then I folded up my fabric up and cut cut around so that I have nine flowers now so nine little fabric guys so um, we're gonna make the petals and we're going to assemble the flower so let's do it so if you can see here I have my flower and to make a petal, all I'm going to do is take and fold the flower in half and fold it in half a quarter it again. So you just make this little petal. And I just take a little bit of hot glue and dab it in the center when I fold it in half, like that. So there's a petal. So I'm going to do that for the remaining eight petals that I have. Okay, so here I have all my little petals made. I have nine of them. Maybe these fun little glue strings between them. That's not a big deal. Okay, so here they are. They don't have to be perfect at all. Um, also, I forgot to mention, um, you'll need a little fabric circle. This is just a piece of felt. You can also just use a circle of the scrap of the fabric that you used for the petals. This is what we're going to build our flower on. So, I just lay this guy down, and I'm going to take my hot glue. Let me move this to the side for you. Okay, so I'm just going to take a petal. And I'm just going to apply a little bit of hot glue in the corner like that. And then I'm going to set it down in like a quarter of the, of the circle, like so a quarter of a pot. And I'm just going to repeat for the other three sections. So there's one more. Put that right here. And right here. Sorry, I'm right-handed, so my, <laughs> I put my glue gun in the right hand. It's hard to see sometimes. Okay, so here we have it, four of our petals just like this. Now we're going to do a second layer, and all we're going to do here is overlap. So instead of putting it right on top on the quadrant here, I'm going to stick it over the fold. So now I'm covering up the, I'm covering up the crosshairs there of this one. And I'm going to repeat, and I'm just going to cover up those two. And this one, and this one. So here you have it. You have two layers of your little petals. Now, sometimes, see, you kind of get that little, this little dent here in the center. So that's what this little ninth guy is for. Um, just take a tad of glue right on the tip of that guy, and then just place him right in the middle. Then when you fluff up your petals, there you go. And a tip for you, um, all these little glue strings that are kind of on here from the hot glue, if you just take a hair dryer and just blow the hair dryer, it'll melt the little strings and kind of blow them off, and then you won't have these little stringies hanging everywhere. So, so there you have it, how to make a fabric flower. I bet you it's easier than you thought it was. 